Hello everybody. Today we have a Ranger AR3300. Um, it is the uh, 30 watt version. I did send the radio in, had it uh, fully recapped and aligned. So that's all been done, all new caps. And from what I understand, it's not easy recapping. These are a lot of metal shields that need to be removed and replaced. So not an easy task, but a this one's done. All the electrolytics are replaced with like good quality caps like Nichicon and stuff like that. A couple things I want to let you know on this. Um, these do have an internal battery, kind of like the other radios. Um, but there's a lot of modifications people do to these to put like rechargeable batteries in it and all this. And a lot of my radios I keep for a long time um, and, and collect them, uh, up until recently anyways. So I didn't have the mod done. So there, the battery that the batteries that are in this tour, when you turn it off and turn it back on, it doesn't go back to 2600. There's no battery in there. Now there are mods you can have done if you want to have it done. To me, it wasn't a big deal because the way you can change the frequency on this. So when you turn it on, it goes to 26, but you know, you just hit the buttons here and then you, you can be on channel really quick. So th there, there's no point in my opinion in uh, uh, having that battery mod done. The other thing um, I want to let you know, um, the RF gain doesn't seem to do anything when you turn it down. This RF gain down here doesn't seem to adjust anything. So uh, I, I don't know if, if there's a setting you have to do. It, it just it doesn't change anything so but the, the receive is great so I'll, I'll show you here so these radios go way back uh very well known for sideband and stuff like that so I'll give you a quick demonstration of the output audio check one two three one two three that's an icon on behind me clarifiers right at 12 o'clock uh, the clarifier is also unlocked, so it tracks receive and transmit, which makes sideband great. Output power on the 200 watt scale. Audio check, hello. Almost between 40 and 50 watts. That is on my meter. Your meter may show more, it may show less. It's just for reference. We'll go to AM. Audio, hello, audio. Doing about 30 watts AM, it's a 30 watt radio. So again, may show more or less on your meter. Uh, one thing these are known for, awesome uh, sideband rigs. Let's go ahead and throw it on the other side. See if we can find somebody on here so you can hear it. Station by 148 Adam here in Parma. Anybody got a copy? Station by 148 Adam here in Parma. Anybody got a copy? Hello? Of course. When it's a Sunday, Station by 148 Adam here in Parma. Hello. Uh, yeah, I got a hell of a lot of cheese and I'm, uh, yeah, I don't know if you went for the deep freeze and everybody's warming back up again. But, uh, yeah, it's, uh, unusually warm. But, uh, we'll take it. Thank you, British Corby. You sound really good here in Arizona. Okay, my friend, take care out there. Have a good time in the mud. Uh, just thought I'd, uh, say hello, uh, to our I've actually made some really good contacts on this radio. Uh, again, the sideband's really nice. I'm including this heavy-duty bracket with it. Radio does show some wear. I mean, it's not mint. Uh, it would clean up real nice if you want to, like, clean up the covers really good. Uh, but uh, comes with the bracket, thumb screws, power cord. Also included is the uh, original uh, Ranger hand microphone with it. So... 
But uh, I wish there was more people close that you could hear. That's just skip land out there now. That's still skip coming in and out. But uh, as you can see, it's really good receive, um, kind of like ham radio quality. So good old rare radio uh, will be packaged well um, and uh, will arrive safely to your door. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Uh, I, I do have a lot more stuff to offer and uh, many more videos to make. So if you can, please subscribe. Thanks so much. Again, this is the 30 watt version Ranger AR3300. Fully recap, tuned, aligned. Um, like I said, the only issues was the uh, battery. So when you turn it off and turn it back on, it'll go back to 26. And I mean, with these dip switches here, you, you could get to any frequency really quick. So really not a big deal. I didn't want a chance having just batteries inside of it. So I just left it alone. All right. Thank you so much for looking. Take care, guys. 73s.